to windmill or not to windmill? That's the question. To drop dimes or go for glory? Whether tis more honorable to drive the paint or drive little bro to the park? To be a hero in the eyes of strangers or through the eyes of family? Both. To be a gentle giant or a force? To be a legend, conductor, disruptor, to settle in, to stand out? To be Zion? looked at players that had their own signature collection. When you saw their signature shoe, you knew it was their shoe. You're gonna find a lot of hidden gems within my signature line, and you're also gonna learn a lot about me. I'm gonna shock the world, hashtag believe it. And sure enough, when the camp was over, I was the MVP of it. And I feel like when a lot of people try to describe me, they try to put labels, tags, and, but you just can't describe something that's not from this world. I feel like that's what ZNA represents. When you want to be out of this world and different, this is the shoe you put on. I'm sure you're aware of criticism. And one of the criticisms is about your body. And so there's, whether it's former players, whatever, pundits, critics, whoever, uh, feel like you need to be in better shape. Yeah, I do think there's a, another gear that I can reach regarding like weight and conditioning. Uh, but I think it's like you said, it's finding it. Cause you know, I don't want to get to a spot where I'm like, all right, I lost a lot of weight, but now I, feel, I don't feel as strong. Like I can't do certain things that I would do before. Uh, so I think it's just finding it, but I do feel like there's another gear I can reach regarding both weight and conditioning. There are those games, there are a few games where the first, my first spread is like kind of tough. And I'm like, man, like, I wonder, I, I wonder why it feels like this. I think I will come to a point or find that point between, like you said, just weight and conditioning where I won't be affected by either.